You have to. <laughs> I just swear I'm not going to do it. No, babies. I do it. Colleen! There's two. I'm having twins. <laughs> if I'm having twins, I need to be wearing the correct hat for the occasion. Much better. It is true, I'm having twins and I am very excited and I cannot believe it. How I found out I was having twins is a pretty wild story. So I wanna tell you how I found out, what kind of twins I'm having, and then I'm gonna show you my family's reaction to me having twins. If you watched my most recent video, you would have seen my family reacting to the news that I am pregnant, but they had even more fun reactions to finding out that I am having twins. So that is at the end of this video. So make sure to watch the end to watch that. It's it's my favorite. I've watched the reactions a hundred times and they make me laugh and cry every single time. Okay, so let's get into a little bit of a story time. I'll try to make it as brief as possible. One, because I don't want to bore you. And two, because I feel very, very sick today and I just want to go lay down in bed. May 5th, 2021 will go down in the history books as one of the most intense, weird, emotional, incredible days of my life. I took my family to this beautiful ranch in Ojai to just have a fun little family vacation with a bunch of farm animals and we were staying in cabins and yurts and fishing and we were playing with goats and alpacas and it was just the most magical beautiful vacation with my family we had so much fun i told my niece and nephews that i was pregnant while we were there right after we had cooked hot dogs over the bonfire by the lake it was just the most magical place in the world i love that i said i was going to keep this story brief and then i'm telling you like every minute detail let me speed this up the last morning i woke up from a nightmare that i was having a miscarriage which really freaked me out because i had never had a dream about a miscarriage before and so i was on edge from the second I woke up and then I started bleeding. It looked exactly like what it looked like when I had my miscarriage. It really freaked me out and I was confident that it was happening again. I called my doctor and she said, you need to come in right away. So Eric and I quickly left the mountain and drove down to get to my doctor as soon as possible. So my doctor came in and she said, let me just look, it might not be a miscarriage. And she looks inside of me, uses all these contraptions that were not comfortable. And she literally screams, it's a polyp, it's not a miscarriage, it's a polyp. And I was like, what's a polyp? A polyp is essentially like a Growth. Basically, my body was just trying to get it out of me. So she's like, it's like, imagine when you have phlegm in your throat and you start coughing it up. Oh God, that's gonna make me vomit. <laughs> I'm very sensitive right now. I'm very, oh, I really have to change the subject. If you wanna know what a polyp is, you can look at, I really am gonna throw up. Pregnancy is so fun, just girly things. Anyway, so we do an ultrasound and she says, you're not having a miscarriage, you're having twins. In a matter of 10 seconds, I went from, I'm having another loss, I have to go through the grieving process again, I can't handle this, to I'm having twins. Like in a matter of 10 seconds, it was, my brain had to do this shift from mourning and grieving to shock and excitement. It was such whiplash of the emotions in the brain. I can't even explain to you how crazy that experience was. So basically the whole time she is telling us that I, I'm having twins, Eric and I are just laughing. We cannot believe it. I, I don't think I heard a word she said after she said I was having twins. She showed us their heartbeats, that they were strong and healthy. I barely remember any of it. So I'm so grateful to my doctor that she was like, get the camera out and film. You will not remember any of this. You are in such shock. So here's some of that footage. So it's just a polyp that you have, but you do have twins. <laughs> <laughs> this is the weirdest day of my <laughs> life. <laughs> Is over here. Little heart is beating right there. Can you see that? Oh, wow. So, oh my god. <gasps> this is important that you guys see that. This is 
mind blowing. <laughs> I've never experienced, like, oh my, my I can't even process. This has been the weirdest day of my life. Oh my God. So I was only six weeks when this happened. So they're very tiny, just little blips. Their hearts had just started beating. And I'm so grateful that their hearts were beating because that meant we could tell that they were okay. Their heartbeats were strong. I can't believe I'm having twins. <laughs> like in what world? Like how is this happening? I cannot believe it. I really cannot believe it. The top two questions people ask me when they find out I'm having twins are, are they gonna be identical twins? And the other question everyone asks me is, is there twins in your family? So I didn't know anything about twins before I got pregnant with twins, but there's lots of different types of twins. I am having die die twins. More scientifically referred to as dichorionic diamnotic pregnancy. I am confident that I said that incorrectly. Dizygotic twins. They have their own eggs, their own placentas, their own everything. The only thing they share is the uterus and that is what I have in my body. So my uterus is gonna grow two babies and two placentas. Fraternal twins come from two different eggs and that means that they're fraternal, not identical. However, it doesn't mean they won't be identical. If the eggs split within the first three days, I think that means that then they can still have their own everything going on, but they are identical. There's no way to know if the eggs split in the first three days or if I dropped two individual eggs, I think. It's very confusing. <laughs> and to answer the other question, are there twins in my family? Yes, my grandfather is a twin. There's actually a lot of twins in my family, which I was shocked by because there haven't been any twins since my grandpa. But I'm wearing this shirt today because it says Moonlight Rollerway. This is the place where my grandparents met and fell in love. And my grandparents were my heroes. My grandpa was always so encouraging and inspiring to me. I was so heartbroken when he passed because I just looked up to him so much. I loved him so much. And so I'm gonna cry, but I'm really pregnant. So please excuse me. I feel really special that I get to be pregnant with twins because I'm the first person to pass that on. I just feel like connected to my grandpa. It's like a special bond that I get to have with him even though he's gone. And so it feels really, really special and I feel really lucky and I'm really excited. That thought keeps me going in the moments where I'm scared and I feel like my body can't handle twins or if I get scared of the birth or get scared of not having enough room or like my body breaking, not being able to walk, like anything I get scared of. I just think about how like, this is how it's supposed to be because this is what's connecting me to my grandparents. And I don't know, I just feel them with me and so, that's what gets me through those really hard moments in the pregnancy and I feel really, really special that I have that. I'm pregnant, guys. I'm allowed to cry, okay? Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna let you watch my family react to the news that I'm having twins because it's amazing. Anyway, I'm gonna stop talking. I'm just gonna let you watch it. Here's me telling my family that I'm having twins. I just found out I'm having twins and I'm gonna show my mom, see if she notices. You wanna see the ultras? Oh my gosh. I'll just show yes. the camera. So baby's okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Laura. <laughs> Just look at the baby. <laughs> Hi, little baby. Wait a second. Colleen Ballinger! <laughs> Dreams come true. Prayers are answered. Holy cow! <laughs> Dad. We're looking at it. And then she goes, there's baby B. Baby B. Can we see both their heartbeats? Oh, yeah. oh gosh. <laughs> see? Oh my goodness. So what am I looking at? So you're looking at see whenever you see one of these, it means there's a baby. Okay. So there's that, but yep. then there's also that because there's two babies. Oh my god. Oh my god. So I went in oh thinking <laughs> I went in thinking there'd be no babies. And there's two babies. <laughs> then I got an ultrasound picture. Do you wanna see it? Yeah. Do you see the cuteness? Uh I think I see two cutenesses. You do? <laughs> You're such a doctor. I'm still pregnant. <laughs> you want to see it? Yeah. <laughs> there, is there three in there? I, I know it looks like three. There's two. <laughs> You're going to be so pregnant. I 
<laughs> I'm gonna be so pregnant. I can I this has been the weirdest day of my life. Like I knew that it was gonna be twins and I knew that you were gonna shoot me showing superstar and we're gonna have the cutest pictures and you're gonna outdo me for sure. I know. I don't know why they've all chosen this exact moment to eat a banana. <laughs> but did they put away bananas first? Yeah, put your bananas away. Go put your bananas away. Bananas were not invited to this party. So this couch, you've heard a lot of incredible things on this couch. Yes. Yeah. This is where I told your parents that I was pregnant. Really? And now you guys know I'm pregnant. <laughs> With twins! <laughs> I have twins. Oh my god! You owe me a job too! You guys got shit got it. The boys knew. Somehow the boys today were like, you're having twins. <laughs> Dad, he didn't shake on it. We shook over the zoo. Jake, J my dad bet him. He said, I bet you it's not twins to try to throw them off the trail. <laughs> Jake, yeah, you're going to have to share them with Parker. So, Look at this. so you guys, we're getting three ba new Ballinger babies, well, Stockland Ballinger babies this year. Nine months pregnant, we'll be sitting on this couch and my stomach will be hitting the camera. <laughs> Flynn, where's the baby? <laughs> the babies are in there? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, you and Parker wanted it, we thought, and were bugging me today, so I was like, I gotta go over there and just tell them I'm having twins, because they already know anyway. Did you know? No, I had no clue. Did you know, Duncan? I just thought it was That's crazy. But it's two people. Do you think they're gonna be girls or boys? Girls. You think they're gonna be both girls? I think they're gonna be a girl and a boy. Judging by the Ballingers, it's gonna be both boys. I know, I think you're the only girl Ballinger that will ever exist past now. <laughs> what do you think they're gonna be? Boy and boy, or boy, and girl and girl, or girl and boy. Good oh, guess, boy. that's a good guess. I was gonna guess that too, actually. I'm pregnant! I'm so sick! <laughs> do you wanna see the ultrasound? Yeah, I don't, I wanna okay, see Okay, I get it. No, <laughs> Wait, is it twins? Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! Stop, Stop it! I'm not even making it, Ashley! Stop it! Look <laughs> that picture! Stop it! Did Our you... dreams are coming true! We prepared for this moment our whole Look life! We're gonna dress them in the stupidest matching outfits! Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> we did not gonna say in their outfits. <laughs> Stop you it! Can keep this. Look, I'll, I'll show you. Forever. Those are two little dots. Holy crap. I was like, Rachel's gonna be so excited about Mary Kay and Ashley. <laughs> but they're probably both gonna be boys. That's my favorite dream. <laughs> Look, we're still gonna dress them in matching overalls. Yes, they're still gonna be dressed in matching overalls. But I need you to look at this. So I have to show you like how weird this is, okay? So this is Flynn's ultrasound, right? So when he was, this is like eight weeks. So this is what you see, you see like a like sack, the black thing's like a sack. And then you see like a little blob in there and that's Flynn. So this is what this pregnancy looks like. Stop it. Colleen, what does that mean? What do you think it means? Stop it! I cannot handle. I cannot handle. I cannot. Colleen, I cannot. I'm having my twins. body is no, no. My body. I can't I'm handle this. Twins. What? No, Colleen. I really my am. Mom, I can't. <laughs> I'm straight up, she checked both the heartbeats are perfect, like soaring, beautiful heartbeats. What? So in me there will be two babies and two placentas. Colleen, you're <laughs> so tiny, I don't, what? God, you could, you're like an overload of some placentas. I know, I'm really scared. So that's why I had to film it, because I was like, I've been dying to tell you. Oh my God. Okay. Make this pop up or whatever it is going on. Let me try to flip this around actually, hold on. Can you see that? <laughs> we do actually have something we want you to see though. There is like actually a technical problem, like serious. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Wait, Nicole, we are pregnant. Oh, excited! <laughs> Congratulations! That is Thank you. You. There he is. How are you, dude? Colleen's pregnant again. <laughs> well, well, actually, we're not really having a second kid. It's twins. <laughs> we're having. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what? Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. So Eric's gonna text you a picture 
Dad, do you have your cell phone? Okay, we're working on it. It's no big deal. And they were only two dots down. <laughs> this looks like twins to me. Help. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Oh my, oh my god. god. Nope. Two babies. They both have heart they both. Colleen, oh you really like Colleen, you really like something right now. <laughs> There you go guys, I'm having twins, I'm so excited. I told my brother Trent, but it was more private and it was like a cool moment, he was the first sibling that I told. And he likes to be more private with his life, so that's why you don't see Trent as much in my videos. I'm trying to respect his privacy and his wishes. And I love you so much and thank you for the positive, kind, sweet response to my pregnancy announcement. I really hope that there are other twin moms out there that can help me out because I'm really scared. <laughs> I'm scared my body's not gonna be able to do it and I'm just scared in general. I'm, I'm not scared of having the babies, I'm scared of um, my body exploding. I barely made it through one baby, so two at the same time sounds very stressful. Anyway, I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time, bye.